Oh my god, guys, my bo whole body is shaking right now. I don't know why, but I guess it's the finale. Hey guys, this is Shao Kirby 707, and welcome back to The Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time. In the last part, we, meet, we met Zelda finally in the Temple of Time, but she got captured by Ganondorf, and now here we are in Ganon's castle. So, in this part, uh, we're actually gonna, well, try to break all six barriers in order to get deeper in Ganon's castle. Now, the thing is, there's actually one more item that we can do. And as you can see, there's actually another one of these kind of walls that we saw outside of Gan's castle. But we can't lift it with just the Serpent Gauntlets. We need, uh, let's just say, an upgrade. Or at least an item that can break that. Or even lift it. So, first off, I'm going to start with the Shadow. Because, well, I do like the Shadow Barrier, so yeah. Alright, so for this one, you may need your Fire Arrows. And wow, look at all the item screen. It looks perfect. I mean, look at that. We got all the items in the select item screen. It looks really cool. <laughs> okay, anyways. Looks really colorful. But anyways, um, yeah, we need that. And maybe the hover boots, just in case. You never know. So, yeah. So, with this, let's just fire the arrow here. And, yeah, and just walk across it. Well, I probably don't need my... Okay, whatever. Yeah, I don't think we need the... The hover boost, but you never know. Alright. Oh! Ow, 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 no, 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 no! My shield is gone. I'm surprised he didn't take my... He didn't take my... You're not jumping up, buddy. Get over here. Give me my shield back. I need my shield. That's my Hylian shield you got there, mister. Oh, no, 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 no. Give me back. And I'm holding the 20 rupee while holding a Hylian shield. Nice. Alright. Now, we also, I believe we need to, yeah, I believe we need to hit it again. No, 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 no. We need to hit the torch again. Yeah, if the torch is on a timer, so you need to hit it again in order to get across. But I prefer using the hover boost, but I don't think you can make it. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. No! Ugh. Woo! That was too close. That was too close. Now, this treasure chest is really important. You may want to get this first before you go through the other barriers. Alright, I don't think we need- No, 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 stop! Stop <laughs> Stop sliding, Link! Sli stop sliding, please! Alright, I don't think we need the hover boots anymore, but inside this chest is something really important! And in this chest, we have- Dun 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 dun! We get the golden gauntlet! So now you can feel even more power coursing through your arms. Yeah, so that's a really quick upgrade for the, well, the arms or the gloves, whatever. All right, no, we need the, okay, yeah, we need the Megaton Hammer. I forgot about that. <laughs> so, yeah, that's why I came to this room first because I actually want the the Golden Gauntlets because they're really important for going a little bit further into this dungeon. So we press that, and that opened the door. And now we just need to make it back all the way I just realized I didn't have my shield. Link's looks so weird without the shield, so yeah, I'm not used to seeing Link's back without the shield. Alright, okay, just- No! No! Oh my god! The one thing I hate about this is that the this road right here is actually kind of skimpy looking, so yeah. Now, every time you go um, complete the, the barrier, you need to use light arrows to um, attack this thing and free the, the sage. I mean, we technically already did, but the power of the sage is not free. So, Impa's a shadow sage, and yeah. The shadow barrier is a spell. Please save the princess. And indeed I will. I'm sorry guys if you heard that. I took a drink of my water. I don't know why I'm so shaky today. I didn't really eat anything. Well, maybe I didn't eat because I'm so shaky. So yeah. I didn't eat lunch yet. <laughs> Well, it's past lunch by now. It's only 2.30 right now. So, that's one barrier down and only, well, uh, five more to go. Now, I actually want to go outside just real quick because remember the, um, that wall that we saw outside of Ganon's castle? Yeah, I may want to destroy that. Or at least get rid of it. So, yeah, we're actually going to go back outside and, well, see what's behind that giant wall. I mean, might as well, since we have the, the golden gauntlets. 
Yeah, it didn't take very long to get another upgrade for the for the gauntlet, so that's actually pretty cool. All right, so let's just go back outside. And Royal Rainbow! <laughs> I have to say that. After doing that picture of Wario doing the Royal Rainbow from Katamari Damacy, I have to do that picture because I always imagine Wario as the King of All Cosmos from Katamari. So, yeah, I always imagine him spitting out rainbows. <laughs> It was actually pretty funny imagination. So anyway, we got the golden gauntlets, and let's grab this thing and watch Link's strength. Holy crap, he is carrying that thing. I mean, that must weigh like a thousand tons. Holy crap, Link, you're really strong, man. He doesn't need training, he can just wear these gauntlets. I mean, for crying out loud and impress the ladies with it. Alrighty, so this is the, actually the last fairy fountain in this game. Yeah, believe me or not, this is the last fairy fountain in this game. And with the last fairy fountain, they give the last and best reward in this entire game. At least I think they do. Next to double magic. Alright. Okay, I'm not really going to say it. Okay, fine. Put some clothes on, please. Put some clothes on, even though it's the last time we're meeting you. Welcome, Scaven. I'm the Great Fairy of Courage. I'm going to enhance your defensive power. Receive it now. Yes. This Great Fairy, she's actually really helpful. So, with that, we have white linings around the hearts, and that means that we have double defense. Yay! The best reward ever. So your defensive, defensive power is enhanced. All right, your defensive power has been enhanced. Damage inflicted by enemies will be reduced by half. That is freaking cool. But in the Mac in the Master Quest version, usually you take double damage originally. But if you talk to the Great Fairy um, in Master Quest, it's pretty much gonna be the same damage that you take uh, originally in this quest. So, yeah. I mean, it's not really any different. I mean, it's still easy without the double um, defense, but I'd rather have the double defense, you know, for upcoming, well, battles that we're going against in this place. So, yeah. So, now that we got double defense, let's head back to Ganon's tower and continue on to the next barrier. We're probably not going to get much done, uh, as in completing the barriers, but at least more than one for this part. Maybe three. Perhaps, maybe three. It really depends how quick we get it done, so yeah. All right, so let's just have this Beemos. I don't care about these Beemos. And let's head on to the, let's go for the light barrier. Because, well, it has a wall up there, so might as well use it. Alrighty, Link, show your strength again for like the second time. Man, Link, he's got some nice arms. <laughs> Kablam. Yeah, Link has really strong strength. I mean, really, he does. All right, so let's go in the light barrier, and we see something invisible. Eh, I'm not going to use my... Actually, we do need the Lens of Truth, actually, because there's actually a couple of invisible keys here that you may want to attack. Yeah, just use the hook shot. Nothing to... Oh, ow. Stupid keys. So yeah, the keys, yeah, look at the damage that we take taken. Usually you take you take a half damage from the keys, but you only take a quarter now. Now you could go through all the chests and get rewards, but I'd rather not. Most importantly, we want the middle one right here, which is a small key. So that's pretty simple, right? Alright, so let's go on through. And another simple puzzle. Wow, this this barrier is giving me Wow, this, yeah, this barrier is really easy. Yeah, perhaps we might go through three barriers and maybe three in the next part, then on our way towards Gaiman's Tower. Alrighty. And with that, we just get another chest, and guess what's inside it? It's a small key. Really simple puzzle. I mean, come on. That's the best they can do for this barrier. And this one's also easy too. You just go around the room and just collect silver rupee. That's pretty much it. This really simple puzzle. Really, really simple. Alrighty. There should be one more. No, two more. Yeah, really simple. I'm not joking. This is a really simple barrier to go through. And go up here. And that's pretty much it. Really simple, guys. That's really simple barrier. 
I mean, it's no joke. And, yeah, this is a fake wall, guys. Oh my god, I heard a wall master. Oh my god, I heard a wall master. Yeah, if you see him still, yeah, wall, master, wall master's gonna go after you. But anyways, past that fake wall is the real one. Yeah, let's free Raru. Hello, Raru. Or should I say Kibora Gibora? The light barrier is a spell. Hurry. All right. Yeah, we can go for one more barrier. Why not? <laughs> we got plenty of time. Oh, yeah, plenty of time. Yeah, we're getting this done really quick. No joke. All right, so the light barrier is down. And only four more to go. All righty. Let's see. Uh, shoot, where should we go first? Um, I guess you can go for fire. Why not? Yeah, let's go for fire. Alrighty, so in fire, you actually need your fire tunic and possibly your hover boots. Yeah, you need your hover boots, so yeah. And that's pretty much all I need. I don't think I need anything else. Alrighty, so yeah, it is hot in here, so you do need your red tunic out. And of course, collect the silver rupees. That's pretty much it. And I prefer using the, the hover boots because... Well, it makes it much more easier to go through this barrier. Alrighty, so there's another silver rupee over here. And all you do is just avoid the fire. And do not fall through the lava, otherwise you have to start over again. Alright. And guess what, guys? There's another one. I was going to say another pillar that we can pick up, but... Eh, we gotta start over again, darn it. Yeah, 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 I know. So yeah, if you fall in the lava, you actually start over again, which is not all that great. Alright, and don't get hit by the- uh, da, 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 Don't get hit by the fire! Alright, we should be almost done with this, so, yeah. Alright. Uh, okay. Like I was saying, there's actually another pillar that we can pick up! Yay! More use for the golden gauntlets! Yeah, I'm surprised the golden gauntlet has more use than the silver gauntlets, which I'm kind of disappointed, like... They didn't give much screen time for the Silver Gauntlets, but for Ganon's Tower, they have a lot more use for the Golden Gauntlets, which is actually pretty surprising. And with that, we just throw the pillar onto the other side, but underneath, there's a Silver Rupee that we need. Alright, so the rest of the Silver um, Rupees are over there. And there's a Torch Slug over there that you may want to get rid of. Alrighty, let's get rid of the Silver... Not Silver, the... The Torch Slug. Blech. Alright, so we need the hover boost for this and just cross the pillar and over here. And simple as that. Now luckily if we fail oh, I don't Okay good. Yeah, if you fail but after you get all the silver rupees, you won't have to get them all over again. So that's a good thing. <laughs> Alright, so yeah, this will be the last um, barrier that we'll do in this part, then we'll do the rest of the three barriers in the next part. Alrighty. Uh, aim aim aim. And there we go. Awesome. And let's go inside and, well, free Darunia. And take off the stupid fuzzy slippers. Alright. There we go. And, alright Darunia, you're free! Hello Darunia! Or should I say brother? The fire bearer is the spell. Hurry up, brother. Yeah, you're my bro, bro. <laughs> Alrighty, so... Yeah, that's pretty much it for this part. I'm not gonna go through the other barrier in this part, so yeah. But we'll go through the other three barriers in the next part, so yeah. Next time on The Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time, we will go through the rest of the barriers, which is the forest barrier, the water barrier, and the spirit bar barrier. So, I will see you guys then, and I'm changing my tunic. So this is Shaw Kirby 707 saying bye!